be in the same room where I was sworn in 35 years ago as the first African-American woman judge. So this is especially a wonderful moment, especially for those of us from the South Side. I, Angela Conley, do solemnly affirm do solemnly affirm that I will support the Constitution of the United States. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. In the Constitution of the State of Minnesota. And the I am energized to have been sworn into my second term between two new colleagues. I want to acknowledge how historic this moment is. Today, my two newest colleagues will be sworn in as the first Hennepin County Commissioners who are also people of color. Ooh, Commissioner Irene Fernando's in the house. Hey, that sounds good, right? It is with this deep sense of responsibility that I carry into my newest title as Commissioner Fernando. I ran to advocate for those who are marginalized or structurally disenfranchised. I ran to partner across all layers of government to advance our most complex issues. And I ran to expand who sees themselves in the stories of leadership and politics. I will conclude by reminding us all of who the fourth district seat belongs to. This seat belongs to our unsheltered, those in shelter, our unemployed, and our gainfully employed. It belongs to those of us coming out of our prison industrial complex and those that are still there. This seat belongs to our youth, it belongs to our elders, it belongs to our taxpayers, our homeowners, and our renters. This seat belongs to the people who look like me that have historically been shut out of this very room. No matter who you are, the seat belongs to you. The last thing I just want to say, and this is cliche, and uh, I just want everybody when they go home tonight to think, you know, uh, it's going to be safer, it's going to be better. And, of course, ladies and gentlemen, there's a new sheriff in town. Thank you very much.